right, here we go. So tonight we're going over um, homework number 45. All right, page 232, 17 to 22. Um, now, I know that you guys would want me to do 19, even though I, thought, I think 21 is also a very good question. But, all right, doesn't matter. It's what the crowd wants. Okay. Two and five sixteenths. <clears throat> so let's see. Now, the answer is going to be two point something. Right? So I'm going to do the five sixteenths part. So now 16 is not going to 5. So that goes in zero times. You subtract, add a decimal, add a zero, bring the zero down, and you just keep going. 16 going to 53 times. 3 times 16 is 48. Subtract, add a zero. And then 16 going 21s. I have a feeling it's going to be one of those questions that keeps going and going. Now, let me look at the directions. No, nope, does not tell you anything about rounding. All right, well, let's see what happens. Add a zero, bring it down. Hmm, 16 on the 40 twice. 216 is 32. Subtract. Oh, there we go. Zero. 16 times 5 is 80. There you go. Nice. All right. So I think that's good. Now, Let's see, what is it? 2.3125. Okay. Now let's do one more because there's something on the other page. No, oh, down there. Okay. Let's see the 40. You can handle that actually. Yeah, there's no need to go over that question. Okay, so let me, you know what? Let me take advantage of this opportunity then to do 21. Where's 125th? So right off the bat, got a 1. 25. Now, 25 doesn't go into 1, so it goes into 0 times. Subtract. That's 1. Decimal. 0. Now, here's the deal, right? Still doesn't go in. 25 can't go into 10, so you add them to 0. Right, and then you go, you get, you just gotta keep going. It's not actually adding a zero. Twenty five just doesn't go into ten. Twenty five going to hundred, four times. All right, so it's a really small number. Zero point zero four. Okay. All right. Thanks for watching, Mister Ink, going over homework number forty five, and uh, have a good day. OMG, that was so good.